Today is Tuesday, February 20th, and when we left town, the sign in town said 80 degrees, and the sun is shining, and I'm standing here with no shirt and an extra pair of arms, and, <laughs> and we're going to go for a hike today. Probably just going to go to the first lock and back, but, hi Lisa, hey. but it's such a beautiful sunny day, we got to get out. And head up that mountain. I've got a brand new pair of boots. Check these out. <laughs> they can't see them. They're camouflaged. <laughs> and they're clean. I got to get some mud and some dirt on them. They feel pretty good right now, so they should be great up on up the mountain. Anyway, we're going to head on. Oh, I got the temperature sensor with me, so we're going to check that out too. And we're going to head on up. We'll see y'all in a bit. Yeah, you can tell it still looks like winter out here. But you can hear the frogs. They know the spring's on its way. No, they don't check the calendar. I don't know if y'all can hear them or not, but they're definitely chatting away down there. I don't see any, but I can sure hear them. Yeah. Well, it looks like the tunnel is still closed. At least the, uh, the Sign's still up that says it's closed. Let's see what we can see down at the other end here. Can't really see all the way down there. But it looks like there's something across the trail. Anyway, I just te checked my temperature sensor. And it's 87 degrees out here. Is that a wonderful thing or what? I mean, just look at this. Sun shining, blue sky. It feels like summer out here. It even feels like the humidity's up a bit. Anyway, we are going to head on. Hi, Lisa. <clears throat> We're going to go head on up the. <laughs> Head on up the mountain, but first, I gotta give my uh, my wife her backpack. Give my wife her backpack back first. There we go. We're up here at the scenic outlook area, and uh, with it being winter and all, and the trees still dormant, you can really see the view around here. So. It's just beautiful out here. I know I say that on every video, how beautiful it is out here, but it's true. Anyway, today isn't about fitness hiking. It's not about seeing what time I can make to the top of the uh, top of the ridge. Not even really about distance. Today is just a nice hike on a beautiful day. Okay. Oh, want to make sure I'm on the holding the camera on the right side. We're up here at the top of the ridge, at the very tippity tippity top, and uh, only thing that's green up here is an evergreen tree. Anyway, we're gonna stop at this here gate. Right there, do some stretching, and head on down the other side. Today's hike is going to take us to the first lock on the CNO Canal towpath, going up over uh, Tunnel Hill Trail. And uh, it's still it's it's still beautiful out. I checked the temperature again. Said 89 degrees. 89 degrees that's kind of hard to spit out when we still got another month of uh, winter yet 
But yeah, we're going to stop at that gate. Here comes my wife now. Hello, wife. Hello. Welcome to the top of the... Not there yet. <laughs> Almost there. <laughs> well, we're go like I said, we're going to stop at the gate, do some stretching, and then continue on down. We got the water just blithering, uh, babbling down the mountain here. The trail is, isn't bad at all. It's just a little bit squishy in spots. Because there's uh, no leaves, the sun's been shining on the trail and drying it off pretty darn good. We're down on the other side of the ridge and uh, heading out to that first lock. Wow, it's nice out here. Anyway, I did a temperature check. And the temperature is all the way down to 85 degrees on this side of the ridge. <laughs> That's still plenty warm enough for me. Especially since it's still winter. I'm up a little side trail here. You can see it goes this way. And it goes up that way. We're not doing this trail today. I just came up here a little ways. To get that on video. That's a little bit of mountain runoff there. That happens when there's a big storm or something. It's been raining for the last few days. And all the streams are really swollen. Ain't that pretty. There's a... Uh, there's some big ones that are really nice out near the tunnel. But since they have the trail closed down out there, I can't go out and get them on video. Now the trail down here that goes to the tunnel is pretty much flooded, but I'd be willing to wade through it to get those big falls that are down by the tunnel on video. We are approaching the sign that says the trail is still closed. Alrighty. Hello, Lisa. <laughs> and we are also approaching a little natural spring that comes out the side of the mountain. Right here. And actually, I I've, I I have taken a drink out of that water before. Stop here, get a drink, and keep going. But it's flowing on down. We're approaching where Tunnel Hill Trail goes back onto the CNO Canal towpath. Now, the Paw Paw Tunnel would be that away, but like I said, you can't get there because they still have it closed off. And this is the towpath here. So, if you're going to ride your bike out here, you're going to have to take it over the, over the uh, Tunnel Hill Trail. And that don't look like it's much fun to me. Well, we're at the first lock here. And we're getting ready to head on down the trail up over the ridge. Back up, back up to the top and down to the other side. And uh, we'll see what our total was. Well, we're back at the truck and it was four Let's see, 4.89 miles. Now it's time to go home and get some dinner. We'll see y'all next time. <laughs>